Hi guys, how are you all doing? I hope you're all well. I hope you had a lovely holiday season. I hope you're ready for 2021. It is almost the end of 2020. Thank God for that, right? So in today's video, I decided to reflect back and show you what were my best purchases of 2020. I wanted to keep this video positive. I didn't want to do regrets. I wanted to do best purchases instead and show you which were the best luxury items I bought this year. Also, before we start, you can come check out my Instagram where you can see many of these items, if not all of them, styled because if they are the best items, for 2020 it means I wore them a lot and styled them up so if you're interested come check out my Instagram I'd love to see you there as well the first item actually happens to be a handbag and it was one of the first handbags that I bought this year. I'm so glad that this ended up in my best purchase of 2020 it is this little cutie Yes, it's true, this bag doesn't fit a lot, but it fits your essentials. So the reason this ended up being one of my best purchases of 2020 is because I wore this bag a lot during the lockdown. I was taking this with me on my daily walks. I needed a handbag so I can put my keys and all that. You don't need a huge bag when you're going out for a walk. So on my daily walks to the park, I was taking this pretty much every day. So actually I ended up using this bag a lot. It is definitely my most worn bag this year. Hands down, I have worn it a ton. So yeah, I, I love it. I don't regret buying it at all. I think it's one of my best purchases. Next I have something from Hermes and this would be no surprise. It is my Hermes Click H bracelet, which is the thinner size the thinner style i said this will be a no surprise because i literally wear this in every single video you must have seen it in every single video actually i spoke to my mom a couple of weeks ago and she was like can you please change it up a bit can you please take off this bracelet and please put another bracelet because you literally wear this bracelet in every single video <laughs> my mom is so cute isn't she so yeah, this bracelet I have worn a lot. I have a few other Hermes Click H bracelets, which I don't wear. I don't know why. I have a pink one, I have a brownish color, I have a black one, and I don't wear those at all. This is the only bracelet that I wear. Let's break it up with a beauty product. And this is actually the only beauty product that made this video. And it is my Hermes lipstick that I have worn so much. Hermes just launched their lipsticks. They were sold out everywhere. They put me on the waiting list. Yes, waiting list for a lipstick. Crazy, I know. Thank God I didn't have to wait too long. Um, so I will link my color. I picked up this very beautiful neutral color. Oh my god, I just realized it is almost finished. Look how much I've used it. I, I just realized that. I didn't know I've used it so much. I definitely have to repurchase this. It is beautiful. I love it. It is matte, very comfortable on the lips and um, it is worth the hefty price tag. I would definitely repurchase this color because it is the best and it's so, so comfortable on the lips. So I highly recommend this. The best pair of summer shoes that I bought this year, can you guys guess? Has to be these beautiful babies. I bought two pairs of orange sandals and I love both colors. They're both very summery. I have them in baby blue and this fuchsia pink color. These are the suede style and I think I prefer this color. I initially wanted to buy these but they were sold out so I ended up buying the blue ones and then later on I found these and bought them. I have worn these so much. They go with everything. They go with all my beautiful summer dresses. They're super comfortable. They're more comfortable than the blue ones because they're suede. I will definitely purchase more orange sandals next summer. I'm excited to see what colors they will release, but I definitely want to buy more bright colors for summer as well. I love these, they're the best. You guys may remember a brand that I was completely obsessed with over the summer was Zimmerman. I picked one dress, I love all of the dresses that I bought from Zimmerman, but the one that I decided to pick as my best purchase is this one because I got so many compliments. Every time I wore this dress, 
I got so many compliments. It is such a beautiful dress and I love this because you can wear it during the transitional period as well. It is very summery but you can also put tights and it will look great with tights and ankle boots. It is very versatile. I love it. It can be worn as an evening dress. I have worn it during the day with the pink orange sandals. I have actually styled it that way in one of my shopping vlogs. I will link it up here if you're interested and want to check it out. I believe it was a Chanel shopping vlog. And you know what? Now is the time to buy Zimmerman because Zimmerman is currently on sale. You can find some absolutely stunning pieces, half price, even more than half. So I will make sure I link down below some of the websites that have huge discounts on Zimmerman and I think I'll be picking some more dresses for summer. Yeah, I can't resist, they're so beautiful. <laughs> I know I bought quite a few handbags this year but there is one bag that I love so much. It is quite a recent purchase, can you guys guess which bag made this 2020 best purchases list? I was contemplating between two Chanel bags but ended up picking the yellow baby. I know this is not everyone's cup of tea. This is currently my favorite bag in my collection. I was contemplating between this one and the beige, the classic beige color just because I've been wanting the classic beige for the longest time. I got it for my birthday. I have an unboxing. I'll make sure I link it up here. I was so excited because I finally found my dream bag. So I was contemplating contemplating between both bags but I ended up choosing this because it's a bit more unique. The other one is classic, you can always find it although it's very difficult to find eventually you can find it. So yeah, I decided to pick this one because I thought it's a bit more unique and limited. I like limited edition stuff. I like items that not many people have. So I love both bags, but this is a seasonal piece, whereas the other one is classic. And I feel, although this is newer bag in my collection, I feel that I have already worn this a lot more than the beige one so I decided to pick this <laughs> for my best purchases. I was editing this video and I completely forgot to mention my favorite favorite Versace mug that I bought. I actually bought a set you'll see in a bit of the Versace Baroque mug and uh, plate, little plate. I keep my jewelry on the plate next to my bed. The coffee mug is definitely one of my best purchases of 2020. I love buying beautiful homeware pieces, especially now we are spending more time than ever at home. So I like to make my home cozy and luxurious. So I definitely need to purchase more of these mugs because <laughs> I only have one. I will definitely buy a few more to have and they have this in different patterns but I love the black one. So I just take this with me in the morning to my home office and my coffee tastes so much better. <laughs> Please ignore the ugly hangers in this video. I don't know what's going on. I wasn't very prepared. Normally I put my beautiful pearly hangers. This time I, I, I'm definitely not prepared for this video, okay? It's really, it's really bugging me. So my next favorite, favorite purchase of 2020 is this Burberry shirt. I saw this back in February when I went to visit my mom in Austria and I really liked it back then but I didn't buy it, I thought it was a bit overpriced although it's beautiful, it's silk, the sleeves are silk and I knew I was gonna get a ton of, of wear out of this I ended up finding this in Bista Village I have a very fun Bista Village shopping vlog which I'll link up here if you're not familiar with Bista Village, it is a luxury outlet I can even dress this up and wear it to a nice um, dinner out and I can wear it very casual with sneakers and leggings. I absolutely love it. And yeah, one of the best, best purchases. You have no idea how much I've worn this. And I also have a few pictures of this already on my Instagram, so check it out. Another ugly hanger coming, be prepared. Let's just ignore it. <laughs> my next 
favorite piece of 2020 is another Bista Village score. Bista Village this year was so good. It could be a hit or miss sometimes, but this year it was definitely a huge hit for me. I picked up so many beautiful pieces from Bista Village and this was one of them. My favorite denim jacket, the Balenciaga classic denim jacket. I love it so much. This has been on my wish list for the longest time and I couldn't believe my eyes when I saw it in Bista Village. It was such a great score. It looks so cool when I roll up the sleeves. I wear this a lot with the mini boat chapeau that I showed you in the beginning of the video and the Balenciaga hat. I love wearing them together. I'm very happy to tell you guys that there will be another huge, probably my biggest, Bista Village shopping vlog coming up very soon in January. We went to Bista Village a couple of weeks ago before the lockdown and wow. Let me just say we did some big, big damage. Major shopping vlog coming very soon. I'm so excited. <laughs> I have two more pieces to show you, one more ready to wear and one pair of shoes and my next favourite purchase of 2020 is this absolutely gorgeous YSL overshirt, jacket, blazer, top, you can wear it as a top, it is so versatile, I love it so so much. This was probably one of the most popular pieces in 2020, it was sold out everywhere but I ended up finding it. I love the colour, it's navy blue and navy blue goes with pretty much everything, it is such a beautiful colour and it has gold buttons, we all know how much I love gold and it has the beautiful YSL logo on the pocket. I have worn it a few times, this is definitely not one of my most worn items this year but because of the lockdown I couldn't really <laughs> wear it as much as I wanted to, however I did wear it a couple of times and I would definitely definitely rock this baby out next year. I'm so excited to wear it. It is one of my most beautiful and most favorite pieces in my wardrobe. Last but definitely not least, did you guys guess what it is? It is a pair of boots and it is my favorite pair of Chanel boots. I am so so happy that I got these. The hottest boots this season the it boots this season together with the Prada ones but these to me are so classic very timeless pair of boots that I can wear year after year they will last me so long they're very sturdy they have a very thick platform they're great for winter they're very warm I love the CC logo on them with the leather detailing, they are so beautiful. They have the beautiful Chanel quilting on the side, they have the embroidered Chanel logo. Let me actually put them down because they are a bit heavy, <laughs> so I don't want to hold them up. These will definitely make my top purchases. So let's say if I had to pick only three purchases, top three purchases, these are definitely up there, very high on the list. Okay guys, that's why I really hope you enjoyed today's video. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below and also share with me which are your top purchases for 2020. I would love to hear. Let's talk in the comment section down below. I love talking to you guys. So leave me a comment. Let's get chatting. Thank you so, so much for watching again and I want to wish you a happy new year. I'll see you next year very soon in 2021. Bye guys.